Hey there, welcome back to another video. So in this video, I'm going to be dealing with another important topic that a lot of you guys ask in my DMs. What is the difference between work experience and internship experience? And how much does internship experience actually account for? Now, this could be a really valid question while you're applying to universities or while you're applying to jobs over here after you come for your masters. Now, let's deal with it. So the basic difference between work experience and internship experience is First thing, do not confuse them as the same. Internship is different, work experience is different. Work experience is when you're working full-time as an engineer or someone else in a company. That's a full-time job. You're not employed as an intern or a temporary resource. Interns are temporary resources, all right? So internships are generally smaller, two to three months, whereas full-time jobs last for a long, long time. Now, let's compare two people. Let's say an engineer is working full time in the company and there's another engineer who joins as an intern. All right. Now, the amount of work that they receive is completely different. Are they on other levels? The full time engineer has more ownership of the product. They understand the business better because they've been working for a long time. Whereas interns, they've come only for two to three months. Now, it takes them a lot of time to get accustomed to the way work is being done how the work is supposed to be done, how to interact with other people and those minor details and other things. Whereas a full-time engineer already is accustomed to all these things. He has full ownership of the product. He holds more responsibility in the company. He has to do much more challenging tasks as compared to interns because as they have more responsibility. So when a person is working as a full-time in a company, he usually stays for a very long time, thus gets a whole holistic view of the business, the business, the product, people, and each and everything. Moreover, when a person garners more and more work experience, they even move to senior positions. Now they're used to guiding the junior engineers and also interns. So they mentor both of them. Now a senior engineer also has more and more responsibility, thus he learns a lot. And in this way, when you apply for jobs over here, after coming for your master's abroad or even when you're applying to universities, they look for it. They look for people who have worked in the industry for some time, a minimum of let's say two years. Below that work experience will not help a lot to be honest. At least get a minimum of two years work experience before you come for your master's over here because that is the bare minimum that you should have if you are coming for work with work experience. Now when you're applying for jobs also over here, they look for people like that. For example, if you're in competition with a person who has a lot of work experience, has moved on to senior positions too, you will obviously not be preferred over the other person because you do not have as much work experience. So work experience obviously helps. Whereas internship experience, we are temporary people, interns. Alright, you have worked only for a small amount of time, only on a single part of the project. Whereas a full-time employee moves from one project to another and does a lot of things in the company. Thus, there's a lot of difference when it comes to this. So do not confuse internship experience with work experience. They're both completely different things and they hold different values. I'm not saying that internship experience does not count for a lot. I mean, the company that I'm interning at, they asked me a lot of questions for my resume for my previous internship. But if there would have been another person with a lot of work experience, in that particular domain and he would have done the interview equivalent to me then also he would have been preferred over me because he has some work experience in the industry and has worked on real life production applications all right so this is the basic criteria that you need to keep in mind internship experience does help but not as much as actual work experience that is joining a company as a full-time employee so i hope i was able to clear your confusions Again, do not get disheartened. Internship experience also matters, but it just does not matter as much as actual work experience. All right. Keep that picture in your mind and you'll be good. So thank you so much for watching this short video. I hope I was able to clear your doubt. Send in more questions on my DMs or keep posting your comments. I keep looking through them and we'll soon address more of these questions in upcoming videos. Thank you so much for watching and I'll see you in the next one.